Ah, uh, this one. Uh, this is basically an endurance test, but um, in ship in shipshifting adventure two, it's actually much uh, slower than shipshifting adventure one. Oh, uh, of course, uh, if you do that, you you fail. Uh, I won't recommend rush though. Uh, I I would just uh recommend you to just stay, uh, stay slow, stay steady, slow and steady, go slow and steady, instead of rushing like me, like I do. Oh yeah, see, uh, cause this would, th cause this will happen if you if you rush. Okay, maybe I sh should should not brush myself. Was close. <sighs> oh, okay. Uh, originally, this is tw this platform that I'm standing on, or six is standing on right now, is actually twice as fast. Uh, but Nick complained that he cannot catch up with the rhythm, rhythm, or he the the rhythm confused him. So I had to make it uh, the same as the others. I don't exactly know how much there are, but it's quite a lot. Well, imagine the pain in Shipshifting Adventure 1. Why is there a clown over there? Oh, don't you dare hit me, I... Where did that clown came from, though? Seventy five per cent there already. <clears throat> oh. And there we go. Four, six. What are you doing here? Helping Verdes to find the lost golden pickaxe? Some miners said that an imposter stole it and somehow ended up in the cat beast's den. 
You mean down there? Yep. If it's true, it's probably gone forever, unless you're paid not to wrestle it back from the cat piece. Scary. Also, who's that boy with long ears? Oh, me? I'm Alucard Romaine. Hmm, I've heard that name before. Where did I heard it? Isn't that a vampire's name? Well, I am indeed a half vampire. Wait, don't be scared, okay? I won't drink your blood, I promise. He looks cool. Forrest is the one with the emerald colored shirt. Your little sister? My elder sister. Oh, oops, sorry. What happened to the quartz gallery? I don't know either. Oh well, see you later. Oh wait, anything? When will you go back to Quattery? Not sure. Honestly, I don't feel like going back to Quattery. Maybe you can live here. Uh, can I? Yeah, of course, you can ask somebody to help you with and get a perma resse bingwa jiggy stuff, something like that. Permanent residence, you mean? Ah, yeah. Oh well, I'll find somebody later. Bye then. <coughs> oh wait, Alucard. Huh? You're not going after the cat beast, right? Uh, no, that's stupid. Why would I send myself to death? Ah, okay. Careful though, the dead. Don't you just miss this, uh, this music? Whoa, that's a lot of keys! <laughs> yeah, no doubt. Better be safe than sorry, because if you get knocked out, you have to do that whole platform thingy again, and I'm not keen on doing that. I'm pretty sure the left lane is blocked by loads of mine cards again. Yeah. Boys, this is it. This is where I first saw him. Over here? Yes! But, I don't know why he's here though. This path leads straight to the den of the cat- of the zombie cat. What? Why would he go there? He didn't get killed by the zombie cat, right? I heard that he was knocked out a few times while trying to get something, but don't worry, his injuries are minor. I'll try to look for, uh, around and try to remember where Nine is. Oh, great. <clears throat> now, uh, one tip uh, I can give to you is that uh, you should try to look ahead. As in, uh, look ahead on where the platform w uh, is. Also, I feel like the uh, the parkour thing is a bit too difficult. That's why I replaced it with this one. Oh. 
What is this? Legend says a wise beam leaf that lives here. If you can show up at the right time, it will provide you an answer to any questions you ask. There's a 3 in 1, uh, no, 10,000 chance that the wise one cannot answer your question. What is the right time to show up? I don't know, no one knows. You just gotta hope that you are lucky. That's not the correct your. Yeah, isn't this a long stage? <laughs> uh, yeah, the, the point, uh, the point that I want to make, uh, the reason why I want to make this stage as long as possible is um, just to uh, have the player keep thinking, "Wow, this place is, um, this stage is, quite, has been quite a while. How can I beat this stage?" There's a blade over here, so I'm just gonna go here. Uh, now you. Oh. Cow! Yeah, this is why I say I really hate the clowns. Because that, that will happen. By the way, um, for that part, right, you cannot jump on the Rubin because it will send you flying. And basically, there are blade on top on the ceiling so yeah you cannot hit the root you cannot stomp on the rubens okay maybe i should wait wait until the platform falls like this so yeah yeah see the, the blades on the, top, on the top of it so yeah mind the bees if you lost anything in here then it's probably gone forever get over it Now in the last game, I'm pretty sure the uh, you have to collect nine pieces of the pickaxe. But uh, the zombie cat, I think it's faster in the last game. Uh, in this game, it will be slower, but you have to collect. Uh, well, you see in a moment. Oh, uh, get out! Get away from me! Oh no, okay, 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 okay. <clears throat> yeah, I have to collect more than nine. Oh, I, oh, I, I made it, I made it away. How did I do that? That was, that was a close shave. Now this one is a, um, I think it's a bit hard to find, but it's actually on, uh, over here. See, the clothing thing. Yeah. Nineteen keys done. That's a close one. Uh, 
Oh yeah, I completely forgot about that. Oh, uh, yeah, um, well, uh, okay. Technically, you don't. You can rush this, but I. I just wanted to play safe. Stupid clown, I hate the clown. 